So I'm here at Frome District Rifle Pistol Club for their mini rifle match. Really looking forward to the match. Also loving these new tops from Jackal Firearms. Thanks very much. Awesome. Quick 360. Right, okay. Let's go inside and uh, get on with it. So first stage of the day, number six from the rear, consists of one IPSC target and eight IPSC mini targets. And I'll point those out for you now. Two minis here and here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight on these portable backstops. And then you've got one large IPSC there. The shooting area is defined as in this box here, so that is within these bounds. So it's a condition one start, a strong arm trail, a holster directly behind the hatch. Right here, first two part of it. Cool. So, we've got nine pin targets, a minimum round of 18 and max of 90. Um, and you've got a five minute walkthrough. Have you got any questions on that one, too? Are you ready? Stand by. So on the left, double alpha, double Charlie. Double alpha, double alpha. Double alpha, double alpha. Double alpha, double alpha. Double alpha. Double alpha. Double alpha. Because as you come back here, you'll see the angles of engagement are very, very tight there. So don't fall into that trap. Got a total of nine paper. We've got minimum rounds of 18, maximum points of 90 for this stage. Anyone got any questions on that one? The same targets as previous. Same targets as previous, in the box, starting to touch in the foot point. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Are you ready?
42, 3, 4, Ipsic targets, 1, bottom wall, 2, and 3. Total of 7 paper targets there, minimum range of 14. Maximum points on the stage is 70. Start position is condition 1, and in the centre line of the box. And it's in the dark. So we will have the range of lights on. Cool. This time. Is the range clear? Range is clear. Do you want to take a safe picture with the light on? Okay, let's get the lights out. Okay, let's! Alright, we're going to it ready. Are you ready? Stand by! Stage nine, no turning back. Condition one, start a recount trail in the centre of the shooting area, which is defined roughly as where you're standing, Monty. Targets to be engaged behind the line, right there. Pressing the button will turn the targets for a short amount of time, revealing the rear race targets as we have seen. Ten paper targets, and you have got one, two, three, four no shoots on the turners. Minimum range of 20, maximum points of 100 on this stage. Any questions, guys? Are you ready? Stand by. Twenty seven, four seven. Forward scoring patch. All right, we're targeting the gates, which is nice. Double alpha, Charlie. Double alpha, Charlie. Double alpha, 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 double alpha. Range is clear. Range is clear. Step into the box. 
Welcome to stage one called Flower. I know, you'll love the names today. You will have 10 targets in total, 4 IPSC targets, 4 IPSC mini targets, and 2 IPSC micro targets. You will notice there are 3 full size IPSC targets with the centres cut out. They are no shoots. On the no shoots, you have the perforated line around the edge. Standard no shoot. On the inside, however, there is no perforated edge. If you clip it, it counts as a no shoot. There is no leeway. Okay? Brilliant. Also, all of the targets are marked with a black pen all the way around the outside. They, they count as standalone targets. So if you shoot through one, you do not get the score from behind the other. If there's any close bits, we'll still have the perforated edge around the inside of all the targets. If it cuts the inside of that one, obviously it counts on the top target. If it cuts only the black one, it's only the bottom target. Is that clear? Excellent. Okay, so you will remain behind this red line here. Um, in a few of the stages uh, on the 50 meter today, we don't have enough wood for all of the foot bolts, so we are running the red lines in places. So it is up to and on, but not over. You're not going to gain much advantage by stepping over, so if you're over, you know, I'm not going to persecute you for it, but please try and remain behind the line. Stage confines are up to the door and up to the blocks. So you have to shoot behind the line, within the stage confines, on the ball, and go to start this freestyle. Any questions? Ten times. Ten times in total. You may have a look at the board if you want to approach the gun. So you have four IPSC targets, one, two, three, four, four minis, one, two, three, four, two micros. Okay, you ready to clear? Right, it's fair. Jordan, you may make ready. Conditions. Set, thank you. Safety can be your choice. Racing start. Okay, shooter. Are you ready? Yeah. Stand by. What's that uh, micro in the middle on the left? Is that a Charlie or an Alpha? Soft. Yeah. A Charlie Alpha. Alpha Charlie, yeah. yeah. Uh, and then, is that two Charlie? Okay. That one. No, that's an Alpha Charlie. Alpha Charlie. Uh, right hand side, two Alpha. Bottom, Alpha Charlie. Middle, Alpha Alpha. Alpha, two Charlie. Okay, right, stage two. Pop it like yourself. Middle squad one. You will have three IPSC targets in this stage and ten poppers in total. As you will see from the targets on the back, they have a red strip down them. Either side of that red strip is a black line. Within that black line is deemed hard cover. Okay? Should you hit said hard cover, your round does not count at all. Okay? It's not uh, Penalty miss or anything like that, no shoot, it's just didn't happen. Didn't happen, okay? And that goes for if you clip it, touch it with any part of the round, does not count. So if it touches it, it don't count. So bear that in mind. Is everybody happy with that? But they are just, they're just one target. It's not, so yeah, it's, it's not two. Three targets in total. Do not need to put 12 rounds on them as 
some people have done today. They are three targets, two rounds only. But should he hit the back line or insert the red, doesn't count. Okay. You then have your ten poppers. They are in groups of five for a particular reason. You will need to engage five poppers, weak shoulder or weak and weak handed. The other five, strong shoulder, strong handed. Is everybody okay on the definition of weak shoulder, weak handed? <laughs> okay, and strong shoulder, strong hand. It's in there mostly for pistols as well, but what we're aiming you to do is you have to shoot it left handed basically and one right handed. Yeah. Is the simpler way of putting it. Okay, you can engage the rest of the target's free start. We are using the 15 meter line here as your footfall. Shooting area is behind, uh, up to this pillar, and obviously the wall. So anyway, the time is mine, you're free to engage the targets. Any questions? So it's only the poppers you got to hit. Popper and okay. the strong hand and targets don't matter. Yeah. yeah. As long as you hit five poppers, <laughs> weak hand, five poppers, strong hand, we're good to go. You can do what you like on the other targets at the top. And it, does it matter which side you go with the left? Okay, the range is clear. Range is clear. Shoot it to the line. Watch it. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Are you going to move across the top? Okay, so on this stage you will have a total of 17 <laughs> targets. Seven IPSC full size targets, three of which are the three you've just shot, so they still have the hard cover in play. Okay? We use on this stage and another stage and another stage, so it remains the same all the way through, okay? Hard cover still in play. Uh, and a total of 10 IPSC mini targets. It'll be a condition one start, and you will start on the 20 mark here with the heel up of the line. Okay, facing forward as in. So you have two, two, two targets, two targets the other side. Now please pay attention to this. The angles are tight. Please do not break your 90. Okay, we put the barricades in so you've got to that angle. You're either running across the back or you're coming around the front. Either way, I want your muscles pointed downrange as much as possible. Please let me know before you start what your preference is going to be. So if you're going to run around the front, I'm not going to follow you because I don't want to come in and be barrel swept on the way around. If you're going to run around the back, I can stay back far enough. Everybody okay with that? Okay, so you've got four targets there. You've got three targets on the right hand side. Four targets on my left hand side. Uh, the only thing to note on this one is that bottom target is upside down on purpose. Not just because I'm in charge, it is on purpose. <laughs> and then you have a final two targets in right here. Okay. There is a no shoot, okay? And please be careful with the just barrels. Please be careful of your muzzle angles. You are okay to come up and shoot over the top. You are okay to come into the side and shoot from 
where you need to, but please be careful of your angles yeah, and sleeping. You can touch them, you can touch them there's no penalties either. Okay? Does everybody understand and clear on that? I don't want to be standing inside and you come literally whipping through and be facing a barrel anywhere. Okay, so please be careful. Shooter, are you ready? Stand by! Welcome to stage four. Happily named, boxed in. How did I get that? You will have a total of 15 targets. It's made up of 11 IPSC targets and 4 IPSC mini targets. Three of these IPSC targets, as we know, have hard cover down and that is still in play for this stage. Okay? Uh, it's a condition one start at the back of the box with the heels touching in the centre. Okay? Uh, on the buzzer. Please engage the targets within the shooting area as designated by the football lines. We are up to and on, but not over. You may use to lean on if you wish. Please try and avoid shooting them. Some people already have. Other than that, 15 targets. You've got one, two, three, four, centre one for the IPSCs, three on the back right, four on the back left. And then you two and two that side. Yeah, these count, yeah. yeah. Part of you. So the only thing to consider on your muzzle angle wise is these back ones. If you're going to go past them, obviously you need to come back if you haven't shot them. So please just bear in mind your muzzle angles. Okay? Any questions? Shooter, are you ready? Stand by! Are you ready? Stand by! Yeah, keep it going. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.
And with Marty from Team Jackal, and we just finished our mini rifle shoot. So how do you think that went, mate? Uh, it was a really fun day. Um, I think, you know, you've done really well. Um, I think you I, I, I Cheers, great. yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, it was a tough one. It was a tough one. I think coming into it, like I know there's a lot of things that we did today that I'm, you know, not my strengths, but I, I really wanted to like come down, find out, you know, have uh, get involved, basically. And it was, yeah, it was really, really well sort of done. I know there's some interesting sort of things with, you know, no shoot aspects and yeah, uh, some quite tight targets there, weren't they? Yeah, yeah. So there, there was some really, you know, interesting sort of movements around barricades, things like that. That I think, um, you know, it's easy to forget a target or two in the run of things. Yeah, I managed uh, to do that on a couple. So it, it, it happens. It happens. We, yeah. we had that. Um, was it the the flower? Is it called the flower? Something like yes. That, the yeah. Yeah. I I got a couple of marks on that one. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was aiming for the white targets, of course, you know, like... Uh, you managed to get a couple. So yeah, um, yeah. Right. well, I mean, yeah, I, I think uh, that's kind of one of the things is, you know, people are going to be looking to speed run it and maybe not get all the hits and some people are going to get all the hits and maybe not sort of, you know, get get all of that. So it's, that balance is going to be even more pronounced today, I think, with a lot of people and, um, you know, we'll see what the kind of overall is. I think there were some stages that were like, you know, um, well, <laughs> I'm bad at this. Sorry, yeah, you can no, cut this. Yeah, yeah. but um, you know there were some survival stages. Yeah. I think today, uh, so that there were a couple where you just really needed to get the targets, and uh, you know maybe not look for the time so much, especially on more uh, you know sort of points. So. Yeah, I made that mistake. I think uh, my uh, I got a five times optic on the um, on my rifle, and uh, I made the mistake of still holding the high point of aim, which is what I had on my red dot. Um, and yeah, that totally threw me because all the all the all the all the hits they went. You know, there were quite there were a couple of misses and a couple of deltas. But yeah, they were all kind of quite high on the targets. Um, but yeah, some tricky ones there. I just need to, I need to work on my um, shooting while I'm moving, um, and um, not forget that I can you can top up as well. Yeah. So I think some of them I knew that I didn't get. You know, I got like an Alpha Charlie or Double Charlie or Charlie Delta. Yeah. Um, or Charlie Mike, but I should have just topped up you yeah know, that extra round on there while i was doing it then. yeah absolutely I, I i think there's one stage where you know i could have pulled the trigger one more time and it would have made the you know the whole thing different yeah. so especially on with you know on these where uh, there's affiliates who engage alongside uh mike you know so uh, yeah and those ones with the red stripe down they were quite cheeky cheeky as well weren't they because they yeah. kind of took up like Probably about an inch or two of the alpha. Yeah, yeah. Down, so that was quite if fun. I see another button activated target <laughs> in my life. You had the pleasure of going first though. <laughs> yeah, that well sucks. First, you know really did. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna excuse myself. You know, first <laughs> you, if you've got a good stage plan, sometimes it just works straight away. Uh, but I apparently did not have a good stage plan. <laughs> I think what it was is because I, I and again I wasn't sure how long they the, the targets were gonna stay flipped round once you press the button. Yeah. And um, it is definitely not as long as I thought, because I thought you could press it go all the way left you could take out that target behind it you know and the, and the other targets there and then maybe go do the next one and then you know maybe two pr two button presses yeah, for the whole yeah. stage but it's really like at it, least four it goes to show you know if you've got a robust stage plan and something like that kind of changes the dynamic it can take that little bit of stretch yeah. whereas i think for me i didn't really have a very robust stage plan to start with and i think i'd got in my head something I just physically couldn't do so it was a it was an interesting one to say the least and yeah a lot of fun though I mean <laughs> getting the cardio in today absolutely yeah, yeah. I, and, and I, I had the same sort of thing I think when um, you know you got that plan in your head and then you're watching other people doing it and um, like an idiot sometimes you think oh actually I'll change my plan and I'll do that and then as soon as that buzzer goes your brain your brain gets wiped because you yeah. Um, you, you know, you had your plan in your head, then you're trying to change it to what somebody else has done because you think that was a really good way of doing it, but then you don't always remember it as soon as that buzzer goes. <laughs> yeah, so. absolutely. You know, it, there were a few where you could have, like, I could have potentially eliminated one or two shooting positions, and I saw other people doing it in fewer positions, but I thought to myself, well, at this point, I've got it in my mind that I know my stage plan, plan, so try and stick to the plan, yeah. try and look for the hits instead of 
changing it and maybe you know leaving targets behind, which you know had, had happened to me already. So, stoppage wise, though, it was all right, wasn't it? it yeah, I think you were. You're okay. running the Smith. Weren't you, I was right? running the Smith and Wesson yeah, uh, with a Vortex one six, and um, yeah, it was fine. I think I probably over magnified once. <laughs> yeah, that was a little bit. Magnification is not your friend. It's always. not always a friend, yeah, yeah. on these. Um, and yeah, one stoppage I think I had, which um, you know put me off a little bit, but uh, always do. So yeah, happy yeah. days. Well, great shooting you, mate. Yeah, and awesome. First time we've. Absolutely, yeah, this is brilliant. Yeah, 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 nice to meet you properly. But yeah, yeah. Um, see you at the next one. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. All right, look after yourself, mate. You too. See you later. <laughs>